Hello, hello, welcome back. Well, it's Friday, so here is our box of postcards home, and this is the one that we did last week, which was considering you know where we live. So I'm going to quickly write this one up. I always struggle with a date, don't I? You think I'd be able to remember by now. So it'll be the 27th. So 27th Feb. Um, not really the weather for a... Beach day and scrummy ice cream. There you go. I mean, you can obviously go to the beach in February, but it's more about watching the violence of the waves, isn't it? Okay, so this week um, I bought along a real use stamp. I'd like to use that today. Um, striving to free endurance, February 1915. It's about bad snowstorm. Um, also, it has on many occasions actually snowed over the week of my birthday. And of course it was or is my birthday week. So this week we're using a real stamp and because they are generally my most favourite thing in the world I am using a shoe image from my vintage shoe book. I'm just trying to decide. I don't want them, they're a bit modern. I do like this sort of crocodile skin but it's, it's quite a weird shape isn't it? It's almost like the ball of the foot doesn't sit on the floor. I don't like that one, but I sort of love this one. How can you not love a black and gold? The technological wizardry of, I can't pronounce that, Perugia's corkscrew heel may have stemmed from his stint as an engineer in a plane factory during World War I. We're going to use that one, I think. So, really, really simple, as always. I actually think I'm going to leave that edge. I don't see why not. But I think I'll emphasise it by running some ink across the edge. And I think because of the black shoe, I'm actually going to use black ink. So I'm just going to run a little bit of my archival jet black just across this edge. And I'm using my brown dauber so it won't be black black, more of a sort of dark line. Whoops, so we're going to use that one and we are going to glue up that picture of that book. I was just looking for something to glue on because I didn't really want to glue on my top. So let's use this old envelope, which I'm sure we'll reuse for something else. Anyway, I'm using stick glue and I'm just going to run all the way around that. It's just so simple, but quite satisfying. And I have come to enjoy these very quick little projects because I think they give you instant gratification. You don't need to have much time in your day. And whilst these postcards home are serving as a form of diary, I've also been doing the little, um, these little square pieces for the 100 day projects. And it did get me thinking to maybe do a little ongoing sort of, mini square quick craft project um, maybe even call it I don't know um, the mini square club or something like that I'll have a little think um, maybe we can think about setting something like that up okay 
so we've got that nice little line just to make it look deliberate because the two whites are slightly different and then obviously I'm going to stamp on the back with our and I'll go with the black because we've used black already with our postage pieces so yeah leave me a comment if you like the idea of having you know this little sort of mini square I suppose it's like an art club really something like that I don't know um, daily squares um, quick squares something along those lines I'm not quite sure uh, because obviously whilst I'm only on day 20 of the 100 day project it is actually going to run out at some point well it's going to run out in about 80 days isn't it <laughs> and um, I'm thinking I'm going to miss it so it might be nice to do something like that okay so we've trimmed that up didn't really need to do that posted uh, stamp here did I because um, because he's using the stamp but hey ho these things are sent to try so I'm just trying to get as much of the old envelope off cut it much closer to the stamp we're going to put a little bit of glue on the back of that one said it before but sadly we don't get many actual stamps these days um, tend to go through sort of franking machines or the bigger parcels sort of go through courier labels and you don't get many stamps okay so I did have yeah here they are here's my posted stamp so again we go back into our black whoops that's the liney bit. And we're going to put that over our stamp. And then we'll put our liney one on as well. So there we go. And that is today's short and sweet postcard home. So we've got this lovely old stamp, we've postmarked it and then we've got this very delightful shoe on the front. So as always thank you so much for joining me, happy crafting, I'll see you all soon, bye for now.